Hello everybody, it's me the Catcher, and welcome back to some more Super Mario Galaxy 2. In the last episode, we went to the Throwback Galaxy, a galaxy based off Womp's Fortress in Super Mario 64. And in this episode, we're going to return to it. But before we do, uh, if you're new, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, you're, you're, you being here means a lot to me, it really helps my content, and it shows me that you care. Um, and my one goal is to make everybody laugh. So, if you enjoy this content and you're new, make sure to click like and subscribe. And if you aren't new, make sure to comment and let me know how you're doing with your day. So, let's jump right into it! I'm very excited. But, one more thing before we do. It's Saturday night, so you know what that means. Time to crack open a cold one for the boys. Oh, yeah. Ah, refreshing. Let's hit it. Boom. A minute into the episode. <laughs> Great. Uh, man. I, uh, oh, silver stars. Cool. You know, one of the things me and T-Tron were talking about, uh, T-Tron plays games. Uh, shout out to you, my friend. Uh, go subscribe to him, because he's freaking awesome. Hey, what's up, bob on buddy? Hey, Stash Man! Thanks to you, this place is peaceful again. You know, I've just got some silver stars around here for you. Go ahead and grab them. Oh, thanks, dude! What a G! Uh, as I was saying, uh, shout out, uh, Shout out to Teacherom because you're awesome, dude, and your content is one of my favorite things to watch, other than funny cat videos, but it's quite alright, man. Uh, oh, oh, anyway, anyways, what am I saying? Use your head, catcher. Um, we were talking about, uh, because his Let's Play currently, well, it won't be anymore when this comes out, but his Let's Play of Yoshi's, uh, Yoshi's Woolly World. Which, by the way, is awesome, and you should totally check it out. Alongside his Super Mario RPG Let's Play, which was just, oh, just incredible. Definitely worth a look-see. I wish they had put the island in here. Anyway, so I'm getting off topic. Uh, one of the things we talked about was, like, how original... Mario Galaxy 2's levels are. I mean, they're so cool, and there's so much fan service to be seen. I'm gonna lose my cloud power. Flower! It's a cloud flower! Jeez, catch, use your head, man. Say, hey, Stash Man! Stash Man sounds like a, um... Oh, that wasn't smart. I am regretting all of my life decisions. Anyway, uh, we were talking about how cool um, Yoshi's Woolly World's unique levels are because there's so many good ones. Like, when I think of uh, like really cool level designs, I think of two distinct games. I think of... Super Mario 3D Land and Yoshi's Woolly World. Because 3D Land was so over the top. Like, way more than it needed to be. Like, I can't even begin to explain to you how cool Woolly World is. And if you play the game, then you already know. Kirby's Epic Yarn is very similar. Like, you guys know, that game... I love that game because of its, like... Like, it takes the idea of, um... themed levels and, like, really makes cool stuff out of it. Like, ah, can't I can't describe it. Some. So we're missing two. 
the other two at? I know there's one up here somewhere. Do it do 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 But yeah, man, I, I, that's uh, that's just what I wanted to say about that. There's so much fan service in this game. It's the same thing with like, um, oh, uh, what is it? Uh, Kirby Star Allies. Like that game. We'll admit, probably not the uh, the greatest Kirby game. But it definitely has a lot of, like, fan service and stuff. So, how's that going for it? Oh, there it is. And we did it! Well, I guess we'll be going to the next galaxy after this. Watch this, I'm about to do, do something really cool. Well, I jacked it up! Ah. Ah. Nothing like a sweet mimosa hard seltzer. Which are criminally underrated for not being, for, I mean, they're pretty good. I know I say that about a lot of beers, but that's because, like, I'm really, like, I'm really like passionate about stuff like like beers like that because like I don't know it's uh it's just I like beer what can I say let me focus that up a little bit perfection let's go to slimy spring what else did I want to talk about today oh yeah I finally uh I took the liberty of watching um, the Peter Pan movies again why I don't know, dude, because I thought they were fun. I thought they were cool. I don't know. When I was a kid, I was super into, like, Peter Pan and the Sword and the Stone. Like, and I remember having Return to, Return to Never... I almost said Return to Dreamland. Return to Neverland um, uh, on VHS. And, like, Return to... J or, uh, the Return of Jafar and stuff like that. Which... By the way, another criminally underrated movie. Because people are like, it's not as good as the original Aladdin. Yeah, you're right. It's not as good as the original Aladdin. But it's a sequel. Do you expect it to be better? It's like the Lion... It's, it's the same thing with the Lion King 2, dude. Like, that movie is... That soundtrack is phenomenal. But everybody's like, it's not as good. Because people... People have to not like things. I don't under I don't understand that. I hear the glittering. Um. All right, camera. Gosh. It's right there. It's this little cavern. Go in the cavern! I'm probably gonna die. Probably gonna die. Yep, I'm gonna die. It's inevitable! There we go. Yeah, dude, like, if you listen to the soundtracks of those movies, they're phenomenal. The only movie I didn't like was, uh, uh, The Hunchback of Notre Dame 2. That one was a little rough. I will admit that one was pretty, uh, pretty unimpressive. But, I mean, like, I don't think Return to Neverland or... Uh, you know, ret the Return of Jafar, or... I mean, even the third Aladdin movie has an amazing soundtrack. Like, you, you have to listen to it to understand. Yeah, it, uh... Okay, 
in. Where's the hole again? Should be. You know what? That works out. Right here. Turn to the left. Perfect! Let's see if we can find a bubble of air. Yeah. Alright, we're coming up on air. really hard. At least I don't have to re-get the comet At least I don't think- Oh man, I totally do! Camera, work with me. Dude, this is actually kind of hard. What a beautiful little area. I love it. 
love it. Well, I consider that a victory. I have no idea how long this episode's been going on for. Alright, we can now advance. Oh, and we have another part of the throwback galaxy. And we'll go there next time on Game Catchers. Thank you for watching. Bye!